Hey everybody, welcome back to Augman Technologies. I'm Jay, and today we're going to be talking about Windows 11 on MetaQuest. So go ahead, get ready for the video. Let's get into it. If you're wondering what uh, Windows 11 on MetaQuest is, it's basically you really have your desktop in real space or virtual space, which, whichever one you want to do. If you want to do the pass through, um, do in um, actual in the real world, you could do that, and then you could take it into the virtual also. But it gives you another perspective and another way of using your your PC. So basically, we're going to be linking the MetaQuest to uh to your pc and giving a more more different feel to it so let's go ahead and let's let's get into how this happens now first off let me give you a caveat there are some warnings for the uh, for putting this on here right now because as of this video they still have a warning in which this downloading the uh, mixed reality link may uh, have some adverse effects on your on your headset. It may work fine. It may cause it to um, lock up. I think they said, or I'll, I'll, I'll put a I'll put the um, I'll show it up here. But basically, take precaution in doing this. It's in its preview stage or in its early stage. Instead of doing this way, I did it another way in which I loaded it directly to my um, MetaQuest using my uh, using using the meta app on my iphone and i'm going to show you in just a bit but let's go through some of the um some of the requirements is basically saying you need um the meta quest 3 or meta quest 3s now uh quest 2 and quest pro aren't supported yet they may have changed um after i upload this video but at the making of this video uh those two aren't supported with this of course you need windows 11 on your pc 22 uh h2 or higher and the horizon os uh version 72 or later so we're going to be going through that later and also a pc with a supported gpu graphics you can look on their site to see if your gpu is supported by this and also you want to have a wi-fi connect connection Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Now, first thing we want to do is get your MetaQuest ready. So get it booted up, have it standing by. We're going to go into the Meta Horizons app on your phone. As you can see here, I'm going in and type in Windows 11, and then you want to scroll down. You're going to see Windows App Preview. Uh, this, we're going to go ahead, click on this, and we're going to install as you see on MetaQuest 3. Now this may take a little bit of time depending on your speeds and all that but just uh, go ahead follow this and at a certain point you might see that it, it looks like it's not downloading yet. Put on your headset and see if you have to um, if you have to uh, press a continue inside your headset. Once you do that you, sh you should come back and you should see the up the upload process or the install process going on to your your headset so you look down and you see a connect to nearby pc you're going to click that and another window is going to appear next to it now once you see this you should see something you should see a list of your computers however many you have and for mine i have pc1 so i'm going to click connect and you should be able to see your desktop And that's pretty much it. It's not a it's not a real heavy process. It's not something um, super hard. And these are some of the things you can do. I mean, you can um, you can type on your PC. You can you can do it in the virtual and in the um, real world. If you do it in the virtual, it has a way of outlining where your keyboard is. And if you set your controllers by the keyboard, you can go ahead and see that the um the pass through for that keyboard it pops up that's pretty cool um also we are um also you can resize the windows you can change them around move them um, however you want to this is a pretty neat thing if you want to try this and do it in the virtual world if you don't um 
maybe you have a maybe you have maybe you travel and you have your little travel PC uh, I haven't tried this on a laptop but this might be something you might want to try with a laptop so you can have a bigger screen and be able to type on that but um, that's pretty much it with this. This uh, it's a it's an interesting little little um, thing they have for it. I say go ahead, give it a try if you feel uh, safe about it. And also, like I said, uh, check out some of the warnings on there. If you have any problems with your headset after trying this, go to talk to uh, Meta or um, Microsoft, and they should be able to help you. So. All right, so that's it for the video. I really appreciate you stopping by, and if you would like to see more videos, just subscribe. Also, can you uh, leave a like, comment down below, let me know how I'm doing. I appreciate your time. Have a good one. Picture the best moment in your life. Your life. Your life. Everything you know is going right. 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 Noticing the birds up in the sky. Fly. The world is spinning and it's going by. Fly. To all of the worries and the fright. For all those who may not have the might, be the one to bring out the light, like a thousand stars shining in the night.